everyone, Chas from Chas's Crazy Creations. Welcome. Today we're going to be doing a stretch class. This is just for fun and to help, help relieve the stress and um, let us move a little bit together. Um, just clear your space and you'll probably want a mat of some sort. And I am using just like a yoga mat, but you can also use carpet or um, or um, towels or anything like that. So you'll just want to get comfortable. And we're just going to take some time to stretch together. If you're interested in this, I'll be hosting a class on a private group. You're welcome to join there as well. So I'm going to turn some music on for some background and let's get ready. All right, we're just going to start by sitting in a comfortable position. So you can sit you know, cross-legged, like straight, whatever works, but chair's good for you, that's great too. All right, first thing we're gonna do is take a deep breath in, and then exhale out.
Great job. Slowly rolling up. One more time, nice and tall, reaching your arms forward. Nice and flat back. And then take your arms and raise them up. Gets a little bit higher stretch in your back. Good job, roll down. Give that back a nice curve. And slowly roll up. Great job. What we're gonna do now is just go ahead and bend our knees. Whether you're in a chair or on the floor, you're gonna cross your legs. So this one's a little airborne. You can do it this way or this way, your choice, however, whatever's comfortable. And we're just gonna roll our ankle.
great job. And now we're gonna be in the middle. And for me, this is one of my tightest, my inner thighs are one of my tightest. So go ahead and relax as far forward as you can. Use your arms to support you if you want. I'm just gonna use, use the weight of your head to go forward. Slowly.
ahead and do some, just a little bit of a pelvic tilt. So you're just going to do a little squeeze on the glutes, put a little pressure down on your feet, and it's going to roll your pelvis. And that's good to just kind of contract all the muscles. And then you're going to go ahead and let that relax. So we're kind of creating tension and then letting it release to help relax the muscles. So we're going to do that again. So a little tension, go ahead and contract. You're all having fun with me. And release. We're gonna do that two more times. And go ahead and contract in and push through your feet. Feel all your leg tension, all the muscle tension from basically here all the way down. And go ahead and relax. One more time. And here we go. Tensing all those muscles up again. Try to keep your knees in line with your feet and your hips. And relax. Each time, hopefully, your muscles are feeling a little more relaxed. Okay, keeping one leg bent, the other leg, we're gonna take it up straight. You can either point your toe, flex your foot. We're gonna be doing a little bit of that as we go. Try not to grab behind your knee because that will make your knee bend. So you either wanna grab above if you're more flexible or below to support it. Go ahead and point our foot, flex our foot, and we're going to point, and flex, and point, and flex, and we're going to let it relax for a second, and we're going to switch sides. Switching legs, not grabbing the knee, either above or below. We're going to point the toe, and we're going to flex. We're going to point, and then we're going to flex, and point, and flex, and we're going to rest it there, and we're going to lower it down. Good job. Now, what we're going to do here is I want you to just put your hands on your stomach. We're just going to work on a little bit of breathing. So, one thing you can do is either have your legs straight. If that's more comfortable, I tend to like my knees up and I tend to rest them together and my feet are a little pigeon-toed. So whatever is comfortable for you, you're going to put your hands on your stomach and we're going to work on a little bit of breathing. So we're going to breathe in through our nose and out through our mouth and we're going to work on slowing that down. And what your goal is, is when we breathe with stress and we breathe with anxiety and tension, we breathe from up here. And what we want to do is force our hands up and down. So you want to push the breath down to here. So that's why your hands are here to help you feel. And you would feel as you breathe, this tension should go down and you should feel your hands rise and lower as you are relaxing. So the goal is that all the breath comes from here. All right, here we go. Just breathe normal. Start feeling if that breath is coming from your hands. Now we're gonna think about slowing the breath. So as we breathe in, we're gonna try to count to four slowly, and then we're gonna exhale and breathe to four slowly. So we're gonna inhale, and then exhale. And then inhale, And then exhale. And inhale. And exhale. One more time. Inhale.
or however far you go down, that's fine. There is no right or wrong answer. If you want your arms back here instead to relax, you're welcome to do that as well. It's kind of whatever stretches more in. Go ahead and lower that down. We're gonna go all the way down to our stomach. Shoulders and hands are close. You're going to reach up and just as high as you can. So if you're only here, that's fine. And it's important you push your shoulders down. We don't want them up to our ears creating more tension. We want our shoulders down. And you can adjust your hands however it's most comfortable for you. And if, it's only, if you only need to, you know, if this is good for you, this is a modified position, that is just fine. So again, this is meant to be whatever is best for you. And go ahead and come down. We're going to roll over onto our back one more time. And we're just going to, however you're comfortable, just rest for a minute. We're going to come back to the breath. I want you to close your eyes and just focus on your breathing, slowing it down, feeling the tension just go away. I want to thank you all for joining me today. Just a reminder, I am doing a stress-based stress reduction movement class. You can go to my website at chassiscrazycreations.com. Click on classes to find out the information there. It is a private Facebook group. You're welcome to do the things with us live or you're able to watch them from the video library after the fact.
Okay, so next week I do have a crafting live. Um, and again, I have classes on both, um, you know, stress reduction movements. I have a crafting class. Oh, I saw that heart. Thank you. Um, we're going to go ahead and, oh, there's another one. You guys are so sweet. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks for being here. I hope that you had fun too. All right, we're going to take a deep breath in. And an exhale out. And another deep breath in. And exhale out. And I'm sending virtual hugs to all of you. If you're feeling lonely and stuck at home, please email me. I don't want anybody to feel alone at this time. I am always here for all of you guys. And I try to answer all my comments and all my questions. And I will see you for sure on the next live next week. And I'd love for you to subscribe to my YouTube channel and my blog. All right. I hope you guys all have a wonderful rest of your day. See you later.